Taste really refers to four, sensitive, really five, I suppose, sensitivities, and that's sweet, sour, salt, bitter, the four well-known ones, and a relatively new taste sensation called umami, at least new in, in the West. But are we born with the ability to already like certain flavors, or do we develop them over our lifespan? And that's an interesting discussion. Taste is ever-changing. Taste is subjective. It has to do with your own palate. I'm watching my daughter, who's 10 months old, begin to eat things, and I'm watching her brain work as she tastes something for the first time. When she tastes sweet things, she tends to... Well, my main reason for eating local food is that local food tastes better. Caviar is... I don't know if it's an, expen an acquired taste or an expensive taste. Understanding what's organic or natural or, or appropriate for a situation um, is what, what people sort of define as taste. I know bad taste, but to know get bad taste, you have to have you know, all the rules of good taste. Of course, you have to have a certain background. Great taste is also understanding that you can't define it. Fashion can take the worst thing that everybody threw out and make everybody want to spend too much money and buy it again. That's a magic trick. That's art, isn't it? That's, that's not bad taste. That's brilliance, if you ask me. The tastemakers of any generation have always been the people who've pushed the envelope. You can't have fun with bad taste unless you know the rules to break.